Guys, we are out on the kayak first night trip of the year and all I'm trying to do is work this. Oh, let's go. That first freaking cast and had a fish. I was just about to say this light line. It's a, definitely a striper. Oh man, dude, what, did, what are the odds of that, man? First freaking cast. Oh, man, not a big one, but definitely a nice start to the night. Little dinkosaurus right here. Let's get him in the boot. Look at that, man. Little dink. Not a bad way to start the night. All right, man, that is that is awesome. We're gonna get this little striper back in the water. Off he goes. All right, let's try to cast that way. Got him. There we go. Let's go. Uh, a little bit bigger, not a giant, but definitely a nicer sized one for what we're seeing. All right, all right, all right, man. So we're gonna try this fluke rig. Could be a great option, could be a bust. We'll find out. Oh, look at that. First cast special with that new rig. Let's go. Why I like this rig is I think it it emulates, you know, a school of bait fish getting chased. And look, I think I got that fish on the teaser hook. Oh yeah, look at that. That was on my teaser hook, the top one that's about 12 inches up. Not a, you know, huge one, but definitely a beautiful fish. All right, let's, but we're, Willing to take that risk tonight. I don't know if you really could tell on the camera, but definitely fish. Oh, look at that. Fish right in that light line just jumping. This was a nicer one. A little bit more fight to him. And look, that one's on the top teaser hook again, I'm pretty sure. Oh, that's why it felt good. There's two fish. Holy sh holy moly. Look at that. That's insane. I mean, that's pretty cool. I, I thought it was one nicer fish. It turned out to be two. And I'm trying to get them both back in the water as fast as possible because... You know, I don't want them to be harmed. There's one. Let's see if I can. Uh, this one's not that bad. There we go. Off he goes. And see, that's one of the, you know, risks you take with fishing a double hook rig is you might catch two fish. And, and if they were big fish, man, I think uh, this rig probably would have snapped because I'm fishing, you know, 20 pound test. I'll tell you what, man, this is the beauty of rain. So right now it's, you know, slightly raining and, you know, the weatherman was predicting a ton of rain overnight and literally I'm the only person out here, you know. People don't realize that fish are already wet so the rain don't bother them. I do love fishing on rain days because I do know that there usually won't be as many people out. Because nighttime could get a little sketchy in a kayak, especially when people are flying around. Oh, there we go. There we freaking go. Right on the surface right there. Let's go. That one hit the teaser. All right, man, this is what we call a striper with a diaper. We're gonna let that guy go. Oh man, one just jumped right in front of me. 
Ooh, got him. Oh, heck yeah. Ooh, this guy's going under the kayak. That's a... I've, I've lost count of how many are... have been on the teaser hook, but... that... I want to say the teaser hook right now is outperforming the jig, uh, which is kind of crazy. Which means they're a little bit higher up in the water column, because the jig... Oh, there we go. There we freaking go. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Another one on the teaser, look at that. Now, don't get me wrong, we're not catching, you know, world record fish, but it is sure a good time catching these guys, especially on light tackle. You know, they, they give you a really good fight. Ooh, had one, grab it and drop it. Dang. That was, there's been a few short strikes tonight where they just grab it, you could feel them, they almost grab the tail, I think, and they just realize it's not what they're actually feeding on. Like there was a short strike right there. That or it's gotta be one of these little rats. There are a lot of rat stripers mixed in. Like super, super small. Like the four inch bait is like probably the top of their level. There we go, got them that time. That one hit right under the boot. Now that's on the jig. Man, that one's feisty. Look at that. That one hit the jig. Uh, put the rod down. Yeah. It's not a bad one. You know, they're all like cookie cutter size, probably like 18 inches. Some Let's take a cast this way. I mean, I just ma marked a massive school. It has to be small stripers. I mean, just absolute. Oh, had a short strike right there. Got him that time. Let's go. Oh, this one feels much better. Oh yeah. That guy had some spunk, man. That was, I was expecting him to be a little bit bigger, but still beautiful fish.